Hey guys, welcome back to Tony's How To's. In this video, I'll be showing you how to set up automated responses in Facebook Messenger. But before we start, hurry up and check out the software just under this video. So let's get started. In this case, the first thing that you want to do here is you want to go to a specific link here, which is going to be business.facebook.com. Now, once in here, what we need to do first is we need to guarantee that we are using our correct Facebook page. Now at the top left you have your Facebook name. So in this case go ahead and click on it and switch over to your Facebook page. Now in this case once you've selected that what we need to do next is we now need to access our tools. Now the left panel here go ahead and click on all tools and under all tools you need to look for your inbox. So let's go ahead and click on inbox. Now in here what we need to do next is we need to look for the automation section which in this case at the top right that's where your, or your automations is actually included. Now from here, what we need to do is we need to create our automation. Let's go and click on create automation at the top right here. And you want to go and select one of the templates that they have. So we have insert reply, away message here, comment uh, to message, location, contact information. So in this case, for example, we wanted to use the instant reply option here. Now in this case, let's go and click on create automation at the bottom right once you've selected that. Now from here, we want to basically, uh, in, the, uh, in this case, indicate what channel that we want to actually use here. So for example, we want to use Messenger. Now, by the way, if you've connected your Instagram account here, you should also have the option to use it on your Instagram account. But in this case, we only have Messenger, so we'll be using that, uh, that only on our account. Now, in this case, it's going to say when this happens, uh, the page receives a message on the selected platform. So by default, that is going to be it's going to be happening and take this action. So in this case, you apply instantly to customer. So the actual steps itself is going to be uh, indicated for us or set up for us automatically. So you won't have to worry about that. So the only thing that you want to do here is you want to go ahead and basically type in your message. Now, in this case, go and start customizing this one. And if you want to add personalization into your message, you can actually use the smiley or emoji icon here, which in this case, I'll just add emojis into your uh, actual uh, uh, message here. But you also have the personalize your message option. So once you click on it, you also have the option to add the first name of the recipient, last name, full name, or even Facebook page name, or even Facebook page link, or the website that you've added on your Facebook page. But in this case, uh, once you've selected, for example, I want to add the recipient first name here. So in this case, it's going to actually indicate the name itself. So for example, we want to remove this one. So maybe we want to say we want to include this to so the very section here. Click on personalize your message, first name, click on add. As you can see, it's going to say hi. Now in this case, once you're done, just click on save changes at the bottom right here. And that should be added in here. Now, one thing that you need to uh, make sure here is make sure that the instant reply is actually turned on. So make sure it's actually set to turn on so that you'll be able to use it. In this case, that's about it. So if you found this video helpful, hit the like and subscribe button and watch our next video.